Hi, my name is Dr. Jenny Chen and I am an orthodontic resident at UCLA. Today we are getting food and the COVID vaccine, specifically the Pfizer vaccine. Because of limited doses that are available, we are at the phase one allocation of the vaccine, which includes healthcare personnel and essential workers. We just want to go get the vaccine. At this point, I was actually pretty nervous, um, but I was also a bit excited to film this video, so I think that masked some of my nervousness. Relax your arms, make it just possible. Take a deep breath, it's gonna be okay. Alright, just relax your arms, make it as like dead as possible. There we go. We were told to wait in the waiting area just in case we had any allergic reactions or any symptoms after the vaccine. I don't feel any pain. This is awesome. Here were the post-op instructions for the Pfizer vaccine that I got. I started my stock investing journey in March and I should have gotten Pfizer, I was thinking about it too. There are two doses of this vaccine given and for the Pfizer, it's 21 days after. I would just like to take this time to thank everyone who has contributed their knowledge and their experience, their experience to making this vaccine. Honestly, I feel so privileged to have received it as one of the first you know, healthcare providers and um, I will keep you posted about how I feel. Some people might say that this vaccine took way too long to come out but honestly I am actually really grateful that it came out so quickly. Drugs, they go through four phases of uh, evaluations and checks and I am super amazed that this drug just went through. Um, obviously it was expedited but you know to make a vaccine it takes a long time. I feel very thankful. Thank you. It is now five hours after my vaccine and I feel totally fine. It kind of just feels like I did a very mild tricep workout and that's about it. Action, deltoid workout, not tricep workout. It feels like I did a deltoid workout, like lateral raises. It is now six hours after the vaccine and I am going to work out. I just finished my workout. It is now eight hours after my vaccine. I honestly feel pretty normal. Um, I did CrossFit training just now. And um, yeah, I mean, the workout was hard, but I feel normal. It is the ninth hour post COVID vaccine and I made a crucial mistake. I pressed my arm. Now my arm feels like it has just gone through like a hundred push-ups right now. It's actually pretty sore. <laughs> ah, so good. put the rice inside of the chicken so that the rice cooks really well and it's like sticky rice
11 hours after my COVID vaccine and my arm is actually pretty ridiculously sore right now but hopefully tomorrow it'll feel better do not touch your injected site that is a lesson all right guys 22 hours since the injection and this is my non-injected arm and this is my injected arm and you can kind of see like this bulge and it still is a little bit sore it feels a little bruised or sore from like a workout yeah so whenever i move it it's sore but it's not as bad as yesterday i felt it while i was sleeping yesterday too which was kind of surprising i still have arm but other than that I feel okay it is now 48 hours since my vaccine and I am feeling totally fine my arm is much less sore but it still feels like I did like a deltoid workout this is dr. Irvin Pal. he also got it on Wednesday how do you feel fantastic oh fantastic oh is it sore no, no. It's not sore. It's, you got it here? Yeah. I'm still sore. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Probably not even recording. I am! Uh... <laughs> we have Kelly over here. She got the vaccine on Thursday? Thursday. Thursday. How do you feel? Left arm. In your left arm. It was numb and heavy. Wow. And that was it. Me too. There you go. Also, oh I did hear that the second dose may be a little bit worse in terms of the symptoms, so I will keep you guys updated. And so I will see you in 21 days.